You say you just tired of f***ing with names That all of these niggas just treat you the same You showing them love but they just playing games Oh, you were a shorty, you not a dame That's your mama, yeah, cause she raised the queen I'm a drug mama and I am your fiend Trust me now, baby, let's live our dream Buy you diamonds, I'ma get you nice things Told you once, let me tell you again Promise I'll be by your side till the end Yes, sir, back at it again with another j, &J Family video And it's your boy, Josh And it's your girls, Jenny and Gianna yeah. And baby girl <laughs> And from the title, guys, you guys already know what we're going to be talking about. We did not give you guys, like, any warning or anything. I feel like we just stopped posting for, what, like, four days because we were busy. Gigi, you can't do that. <laughs> you can't do that. We were busy, like, moving, packing, and everything. And a lot of you guys want to know what the reasoning is, is why we moved and all of that. So we're going to get into that. But before we get into that, please don't forget to give this video a big like. Go ahead and comment and subscribe and join the family. And we're going to go ahead and give you guys the drop of Jesus. Yes, Gigi? Thank you. The verse of the day is, And over all these virtues put on love, which binds them all together in perfect unity. <laughs> and that is Colossians 3.14. So, who wants to start? You? Well, Gigi's not going to start, but you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, so reason number one why we moved was, to be honest, because since Jenny's about to give birth, like, very, very soon, like, we already see how it was with Gianna. We already know that having two kids will be a little bit more challenging, but just more so in the beginning because of the newborn and Gigi's still only, like, one years old. So, what we wanted to do was we wanted to live closer to family, in a sense, so closer to, like, my mom, my siblings. We're still close to Jenny's family, but so that it's just easier, like, if we randomly need help or anything like that, or to watch Gigi. Anything, you know what I'm saying? Because we still have like a lot of stuff, like even outside. <laughs> you just want to be all up in the show, huh? But yeah, so even outside of content creating, we still have like a lot of stuff that we do on the back end that like you guys don't know about or you guys will know about soon. But. Pretty much, like, so we just, yeah, you know, just in case we wanted, like, some help, mm -hmm. uh, can you watch Gigi real quick? It's a lot easier with us staying over here compared to where we were at before. I don't know if that makes sense. So, that's the reason, that's, like, reason number one why we did that. You want to go ahead and tell me another And then another reason also, too, guys, if you guys didn't know, we live in Cali, and it is pretty pricey in Cali. But obviously Josh and I, we do not want to rent forever. We have a lot of goals that we want to set, but it can be a little difficult if you're paying like really high rent, especially for an area, <laughs> especially for an area that's not as safe as we thought. Like where we were living, where we were living was really, really nice, but like on the outside of it was quite questionable, which we obviously didn't know. We wouldn't have like moved there if we knew that. So that's one of the big things because we obviously have a family, a growing family. We're about Gianna. to have a <laughs> We're about to have a this is a real life with a toddler. If you don't have a toddler, this is a glimpse of what it's like having a toddler. But basically we wanted to live in an area that was really safe. So we really did our research, not that we didn't do it there, but we like did extensive <laughs> research to make sure because we don't want to just be moving around. But we also want to save, like we have a couple things that we want to get, you know, in the future. We also want to own a house. We want to be homeowners. We don't want to be renting forever. Sometimes with renting, it probably makes it feel like you're like throwing, throwing all your, your money, money away. away because, I mean, at least when you're going to own a home, you're putting rent and that's towards you owning the home. Like... Putting rent towards apartments that are really expensive or whatever the case may be where you can't like rent to own really feels like you're wasting your money. At least Josh and I, we just had like a real like honest talk like, okay, where do we see each other in a couple of years? Like what do we want to have in a year or in two? And what are we doing now that's helping us get towards those goals, if that makes sense? And we realized like where we were at is really kind of setting us back. Not that we can't live there. But for what we want to do, it's going to take us longer to get where, if that makes sense. Like, we want to get a house, we want to get a new car, we want to get, um, 
just like other things, like just put money in savings for rainy days or whatever, like to be able to add more money into savings than what we're able to do now because of the cost of living at where we're at. So that was a reason. And of course, um, obviously someone's gonna need to watch Gianna when we do go into- Travel, do all these Oh yeah, things, or traveling like... to, or like when I'm about to give birth, we can't bring Gianna um, into the <laughs> hospital. To be quite honest, I think that would be really chaotic if we did bring her, because she would probably try to pull like all the cables. So we needed like family clothes so that we can, you know, not really, What's the word? Not really stressed about like, oh god, like who's gonna watch Gianna while I'm yeah. like in labor, things like that. And those were things that I feel like we had in our mind, and we're like, oh, the distance isn't gonna be really a problem. But with other factors that were kind of cons for us, it became like a bigger Issue. factor for us. So yeah, that's pretty much why we're not gonna be doing a home tour because of privacy reasons. Y'all are like, not all of you, but, but there's some, some people out there. Of you, man, um, are a little. They're detectives. We, yeah. we, we, did a, we, did a, we did a home tour last time, and I'm telling you, there's people who will DM you and be like, I didn't know that you stayed at these apartments. Oh, that's crazy yeah. that you stay over here. Or what's your, oh, oh, this, oh, I know exactly where this apartment is mm -hmm. and all that type of stuff. So that, like, you and I don't know if yeah. that makes sense to you. We need to protect our family. Yeah, like, that's a little scary. So I'm not, like, I understand. We've seen on TikTok, we've seen on Instagram. Uh, I mean, you guys didn't know about it. So mm -hmm. now since you guys know, I, I doubt you guys will ask, but there was like, especially on TikTok, we got Tom, over a hundred people <laughs> <a video. laughs> who, who hit us up talking about like, oh, hopefully you guys give a house tour. And like, we want to, mm -hmm. but after like, after when we moved to where we moved at yeah, before. Yeah, and even the spot before. Yeah, but there were so many people yeah, just... who were just like, oh, you stay here. I'm talking about the day we moved in. Remember, I had gotten a DM from someone saying like, oh, that's crazy, you live here? And they started yeah. giving me the rundown of the whole apartment. Which is like, I'm sure you guys have good intentions, but we don't it's know. It's scary, you know what I'm saying? everyone has good yeah, intentions. Yeah, because there could be someone who like, yeah, so, is weird. Yeah. And like, since we got Gigi here, you know, Jenny, and, and then the other stuff. No, we ain't trying to, we ain't to, trying to deal with none of that type of stuff. So we hope so. you guys understand. We're still going to be sharing our lives with you guys. We just have to obviously protect our family first. And you guys will see little glimpses of the house, obviously, like from like when we're recording. Yeah, like we'll vlog inside. Yeah, we're just not but like show we're not going to do like a like... full on, you know, because we don't really know like what to show and not show for it to become an easy, predictable thing of like where we live, if that makes sense. Um, and so, we yeah. found this spot online, so I mean, if yeah, we can so find it online, somebody could find, else could I'm find sure it online. I'm sure you guys online. could if you like really did some digging and searching. Hopefully not, but like it's just mostly because. The world that we live in is not safe. You don't know like what people's intentions are and we just have to protect our family the best that we can and not give little snippets of where, you know what I mean, we can endanger ourselves. Like I'm not saying that you guys are having bad intentions, but like we said, we just don't know everyone's Everyone intentions. Watches, yeah. So we just have to, you know, we know we have a big loving family, but we also know that there's people that watch our videos that maybe are not loving and are just like trying to be like, ooh, what's this, what's this, you know what I mean? So that's pretty much it, right? That's that, and also like the last reason why we moved was also like where we were living at before. We had kind of like checked it out, but like we didn't really check it out too well. It was a little, it was a little dangerous. You know what I'm saying? Like Jenny, Jenny couldn't really go on walks outside. She couldn't do anything. When I say there was homeless, like our complex was was perfect, but but everything else like outside of it and all that type of stuff. Like, it wasn't like, I had, like, there's nothing wrong with homeless people. It wasn't the homeless people. It was like, there was, like, literally drug addicts. Like, yeah, like everywhere, outside. Like, Jenny couldn't go to the store across the street after a certain, like, time. Like, once I had, like, 5, 6 p.m., it was weird outside. You know yeah, what I'm saying? like, the neighbors were cool, the ones that we've met, but it was just kind of, like, the people GG. outside of the community. I feel like at our community, it was easy access to get in if you didn't Thank live you. there. And I think that was kind of the concern for us because... You would walk out, he would walk out and check the mail because we would get packages all the time. I'm sorry, I just farted. Uh, packages. <laughs> okay. All the time. And, um, like, a homeless person, like, approached him, but he was, like, an aggressive, like, homeless person. Man, and tried to take like, my shoes. He did. No cap. He well, did take He did take shoes. my shoes. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. But I'm saying, insane. like, he threatened me, though. Like, you understand yeah, what I'm saying? And, like, it was weird. Not like he took the shoes off my feet, but yeah, like the man, yeah, yeah, like, <laughs> yeah, no, nah, not like that. 
But the man was pressing me for like these shoes that like yeah. I was gonna throw. Like I'm like, all right, here. Like it ain't it ain't that big of an issue. Yeah, but it's we, like my gosh. We had a couple encounters. I didn't. Josh had a couple encounters that were just Weird not safe. Stuff. And if Josh was just always nervous, like what if the roles were switched? What if it was me out there at night? Or what if it was me and Gianna out night? You know what I mean? Just things that were concerning. So that's pretty much why we moved, y'all. I know we didn't give you guys like a really big update. I feel like it was all y'all. I'm 35, 36, whatever the doctors want to say. <laughs> she's 36 weeks on, but, on her flow. The doctor says she's 35 weeks in like yeah, four days. Yeah, so I'm like, no, whatever. What I do know is I'm day. pregnant in, th in third trimester. Nobody can argue me on that. Gigi. And we Gigi. have Gigi. stuff to do. We got to get the girls okay. room like we completely right ready. After. And yeah, we just had a lot Thank going you. on, so that's why we weren't like posting as frequently because it was Thank quite hard you. to like make videos while moving. Um, and Josh was like lifting all the heavy stuff because obviously, like, I wasn't Thank picking, picking stuff. I packed, but I didn't even pick up the heavy stuff. Josh just did. But yeah, <laughs> so that's pretty much why we moved and um, answering a couple questions that we kept seeing on TikTok and like on Instagram and everything. And you have anything you want to say? No, that that that's pretty much it. I mean, again, like the like the super pluses that we like about this house, uh, you guys can't tell now. You guys will probably be able to tell in like later on, but like videos later on. But like our master bedroom, it's probably as big as our like first apartment. Like this is not an oh, exaggeration. No, yeah, that's true. Like we're we're sitting in like the middle of the master bedroom. There's still like a whole extra space right there then the yeah. bathroom is big and so i'm saying all this what i'm saying is like we really love the house there's a backyard Gigi can go in the backyard and play i'm yeah. about to go get her a play set and all type of stuff so she can you know have swings Gigi loves the swings we got a spa in the backyard fireplace you know what i'm saying and the neighborhood is mad safe so jenny could go on a walk with Gigi, or all of us could go on a walk and all type of stuff the neighbors were really really nice first day we moved in came over and everything like that. They were saying, introduce themselves. They were saying hi and all that type of stuff. <laughs> oh! <laughs> no, <I> just went. <laughs> Bless you. But Thank yeah, you. so that's 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 pretty much it. We wanted to give you guys an update because we did move and everything like that. I know it seemed like it was really, really like abrupt and fast, but honestly, this was like really thought out for a while. After like we had like had a few incidents at our other apartment, we were like, okay, you know what? We got to look for a new place and anything like that. Second, this one came available. We took it. So, again, thank you guys very, very much. I know that we haven't posted in, like, I want to say, like, a week. Six Maybe days, like, days, a week or something. Right. Some, some like that. We will we've be back. Busy. Yeah, it's yeah, just because we've been moving. We will be consistent. We'll be back. We love posting. Honestly, like, we genuinely love posting and making videos. So, I promise you that, that we'll. You can see what Gianna's doing behind Gigi's the camera. Gigi's over there right modeling now. right now. She's modeling. Hey, go ahead. Yeah. She's <laughs> she modeling that little thing. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This girl is being What are these days we're going to see recording a YouTube video of just like what she does?